What's up guys, Classic Gamer here and welcome to another unboxing video. One that I didn't actually think I would do. Um, I've been meaning to actually change my mic on my uh, computer now for a while. I've had some Plantronics, um, which I bought for about 25 quid on eBay. I think they were refurbished edition, but they were fine. And I've been using them for a long time. They're very comfortable. They're very, very good for what they are for the price I paid. I think they are actually surround sound as well. And they're a very, very good headset. They're a stereo headset. I think from what I believe, remember. But I thought to myself, when I got my Astros, these ones, and I use these for my PS4, but I feel that they're better suited for my um, PC. And the reason being for this is because to use my Astros, I need to have a splitter for the optical cable, and that was extra money. So I bought yesterday the headset I've always said was the best headset for PS4 in my belief for the price that you pay for up about £80 is the gold headset. But this is the newer edition. I rev I unboxed the gold and I, I love the gold. The golds were really, 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 really good. A brilliant set of, um, he a brilliant headset. And I've just realised that I haven't got um, anything to um attach this box oh, shit so I'm going to have to break the box and get into it that way so these are the newer uh, golds they're an upgraded version as you can see the headband is vastly improved compared to the old box just bear with me what's this this is the old box and this was actually my first uh, gold original headset as you can see if you can if you look at the two boxes very very different completely different um the headband on the on the old one actually had something called crack and mine actually cracked and also the stuff inside the ears also peeled so that was always not good so i bought these yesterday i wasn't going to buy them i was going to buy the hype x cloud 2 or something and they were a wired headset but i thought well i could either use these for my pc or i could use them for my ps4 so, I decided I think I'm probably going to use them for my PS4, because my friend got them also, and he says they're really good, and he's like, he's in a fishbowl or something, he described it as, and uh, you're in like, your own little world. But these are these are actually made to work with the uh, VR headsets. You can see on the side of the box there, they're made purely for this, with a newer version of the headset. And there's two microphones built in. Which is really, I don't know why there is two microphones built in, but we're going to open this bad boy up and see what we've got. I like the way it's packaged out already. Like the instructions are on the top, nicely, nicely set out, nicely packaged. I like that. And Sony always pride themselves in packaging stuff really well and, you know, making stuff look really neat and tidy. We've got the instruction manual. I'm not going to open any of this. Um, speaks for itself. That. And we've got... Uh, this is that I like this in this packaging. It actually is better. It's set out nicer. It's packaged better. We've got the uh, cable if you want to plug it into your controller, which you can do. It can be a wired headset. You've got the dongle, which one of my other friends, his dongle actually burnt out. And then you've got the head, the uh, here, what cable here itself. And then when we unattach these little bits here, which keep that really nicely. Placed, you know, I like how things are packaged. I think that's really important. And people might say, "Why are you going on about the packaging? Get on with the headset." Well, if you don't package things nicely, then it's not going to be presentable, is it? And here is the headset. And what I noticed straight away is it's very, very light. Oh my fuck! These are light as hell. I picked them up and they they weigh next to nothing. That you know you hardly really notice. But that's probably why you think uh, my friend said he felt like he was in a fishbowl. Uh, you've got all this plastic, which um, I'm going to remove. You do have to remove these things around the side, but this is the actual headset. And it seems to be an over-ear headset. And I can't really hear much. I can't really hear my voice or anything. Um, to be honest with you, I don't really know if I like these um, on first impressions. They don't cover your ears very well. Um, but they feel, they do, they feel I, I'm going to have to use them and see what I think. I can't really judge them on just putting them on my head for about a minute. 
Um, but I do want a bit. I did want to buy a bear headset for the computer, and uh, with this kind of wireless headset, it's a case of just plugging in a USB and using the headset. I also need a second headset because I am going to do some dual LPs with friends at the flat. So apologies for background. Um, it's really not very great right now. <laughs> but yeah, I'm not sure about these. At the first impressions, like how they feel in your head, they do feel a bit weird. Um, maybe it's because I've got all the stuff on it. That could be why. But um, that's the unboxing video for my gold headset. Um, I'm going to say that I like what they've done. And I think it's um, I think it's good. I think it's good. Uh, they've definitely improved on the original uh, without a shadow of a doubt. Um, I'm just going to put the link back. So that's my unboxing video. So I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, be sure to subscribe and give me a like on the video and to tell me anything that you, that, what, what do you think of the headset? You know, do you think it looks good? Do you think it, you know, it looks bad or whatever? I mean, you can get the Platinums, but um, I, I'm not really sure about the Platinums, you know, now that I've used them. Um, they're, they're really good, but uh, are they worth 130? Do you want to buy that, spend that much for these? I don't really know. Um, because these are definitely an improvement and the gold were fine. You know, these are for 80, for about 70 pounds from Argos, you're getting a very good headset. I mean, top of the range. Um, these are the best probably in their price range. Uh, it's built in microphone, but when I actually compare, when I actually had a mic test and I heard one compared to these, these don't match up. And these are better. These are a 278, seven, an 80 pound headset. However, these for what they are, are perfect if you just want to have gaming or you want to be immersed. And because they're fine for the for the VR, they keep you immersed. Um, and it says on here, 7.1 virtual surround sound, PS um, VR optimized, and two built-in microphones. Uh, and it just says um, developers game create audio modes, and yeah, so it just says modes. Oh, it's all in, it's all in other languages. But no, from what these are, these are really like from what it is, it, it's really good. I mean, it, it's a perfect headset for seventy quid. You can't go wrong. Um, I personally wouldn't go for anything less than fifty if you want to get a headset for your PS4. If you want to hear footsteps and stuff, you need to start. This is where I'd say start from. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you all in the next unboxing video, whatever that one may be. I'm not quite sure yet. It probably won't be until I get Spider-Man in September. So until then, guys, thank you for watching this unboxing, and I'll see you next time.